In this video, we'll look at the various power options available for the IQ4 digital back. First of all, we can charge via USB-C. This can either come from a computer or from a powered socket in the wall. You will need about 13 watts of power to charge the digital back. Once we plug this into the digital back, we can see it will immediately start charging. If out in the field, we can use a USB-C power bank. This is especially useful when using cameras that do not include power sharing. Here you can see if we plug the power bank into the IQ4 digital back, we can change the battery without the back powering off. Depending on the voltage provided, this will either sustain the battery life or charge the digital back. This solution can also be used with the XF camera system. Finally, if tethering over Ethernet, if you have a powered Ethernet connection, it can charge through here. If not, we can add something like a powered repeater. Here we have a TP-Link which will add power into the Ethernet connection and allow it to charge the digital back. All charging and power options can be found under Menu, Power Management, and if we scroll down to the bottom we can go to Power Info and see how much power is being provided from our power source. This will allow us to see whether the back will be charged or not.